Hello everyone. In this lecture, you will learn how to add a another API as a retrofit instance. I means how you can add multiple base URLs into your same projects. So for uh, the first one hour is the API from Game Hubs. Now we will use a another geolocation API which is also free and using this API we will be able to show users IP address and its country code and the image dynamically okay so uh, let me show you the API this is the API you can note down it api.country.edge okay you can forget the last parameter api.country.edge okay it is have two parameters the first one is ip and second is country so using the ip key we can show the ip address and using the country key we can show the country code and using this country code we can get the image of that country uh, by using a default urls okay so for now open your android studio go to app java under your package name go to the api files and inside api client as you can see we have a one retrofit instance or client which was from game apps so how you can add multiple base urls so what you can do you have to just create a another retrofit retrofit instance uh, like this one so you can simply copy this one okay now paste it after the first one okay now you have to give a different uh, name to your client let's uh, name it get country client okay now you have to change the base urls as you can see uh, this is only uh, there is no other parameter so this url is itself a complete url either you can say it is a base url okay so for getting a to make the call request by get request we can expand it using the other parameter like this id is equal to uh, you can give anything okay just for calling purpose okay so let's remove the this url base url now paste it our here now it has been done you not need to change any other things but we have to uh, create a another retrofit instance variable okay so let's uh, you can create it there uh, the from here let's private static retrofit and let's name it retrofit2 okay it is totally up to you you can give any name to your variable and just copy this one okay now paste it here also there and also return the retrofit2 okay now our retrofit get country client is ready okay when we making a request using our response class then we will use this method get country client in our fragment as you can see we are showing the this information in the locate me fragment in the uh, main activity okay so this video has been completed uh, in the next video i will i will meet you